What's up guys? I've told you guys I am on an organization frenzy. I'm definitely getting some areas in this home that need some attention with organization and my kitchen is one. As you can see behind me, these cabinetries are a hot mess. And I have plenty of cabinetries, but when I seem to go put something new in the cabinets, I can't fit. So that means it needs to be organized and decluttered. So that's what we're gonna be doing on today. I desperately want to get this done too before the holidays hit all of us at the end of the year. So that helps me to go ahead and get started uh, before that happens. And I want to share with you this hot mess in this kitchen, guys, because I promise you, it's a mess. I want to share it with you. But before I do, if you had not already hit that subscribe button, go ahead and click it below. Uh, also, do not forget to like and share these videos. This helps me a great deal and I truly, truly appreciate it. But let's go ahead and jump into this video. Alright guys, so the kitchen is the next place to be organized and this is what we're looking like. Everything is just pretty much thrown in these cabinets and so I really need to get in there and declutter. Also, if there's anything I need to give away, I need to give it away um, and just make everything a little neater and tidier. Um, but when I tell you every single cabinet is ridiculous, it's ridiculous. I can't tell you enough how much I need to declutter these cabinets. I have games and oh, it's just, it's, it's ridiculous. The only thing look good, coffee and tea still looks good. All that stuff is still organized, but everything else is just pretty much thrown in these cabinets and nothing makes sense. And I have plenty of cabinetries in this kitchen. However, when I go to put something away, it's just a complete mess. I can't fit it anywhere and I know I have plenty of space. It's just that everything needs to be organized. I have holiday things in here. I've just kind of make, made this the home decor holiday cabinet here. I mean, guys, I'm not even kidding. Like, it's just, it's just time. It's just time. And it just, it gives me a little bit more peace <laughs> to have everything in this appropriate place. I also have these cabinets up here in the center of the island. And I've just kind of, again, just stuck things in these cabinet trees, no rhyme or reason why it's in there or they're not even neatly in there. So, with that being said, we're gonna get started and try to get this mess organized. I am, I picked up this from Amazon, these little spice jars, um, with the little bamboo tops. And here are the labels that goes on them. So I'm going to, uh, attempt to organize my spices with this um, I really love these labels and they have many many labels they also have the expiration date labels this was pretty good set um, I will link it below in the description box but again this came from Amazon also got a, another wood step for the pantry um, for Amazon so Anyway, guys, let's get to it. Let's see if we can get this mess rectified in some sort of way. I also have some things I've already had, uh, some baskets, and this little thing was in my drawers at our old house, so I'm going to try to repurpose some of this stuff, and I did pick this up. This is new. I picked this up from Target, so we're going to see what we can do with this and what we have and try to get it organized, so let's go, guys. All right, guys, first and foremost is the junk drawer. I'm not the only person in their house that has a junk drawer. I feel like these just happen. I think we intended for them to happen, but they happen. So it's time for me to tackle this junk drawer first. Um, I don't even know what's in it, to be honest. <laughs> I have no idea. Again, just like the cabinets, I think we just kind of threw stuff in in the drawer and just let it alone um i'm repurposing these 
I had these, I think these came from Ikea, if I'm not mistaken, years ago. Uh, I got these from Ikea. So I'm gonna try to repurpose these in this drawer. Um, I know the drawer is much wider than this and longer than these, but I think for the time being, it will just kind of uh, sort things in it for me. Try to repurpose and recycle anything you don't need. So that's what I'm going to attempt to do with these in this drawer. This drawer is the first step to get this kitchen organized. It's ridiculous. But yeah, let's do it. So my set strategy is to take one set of cabinets at a time. So two drawers are done. Let's see if I can straighten this all up. So here's a mommy's tip. I keep in the kitchen, I kept a bag of quiet time activities that Kaylee can do while I'm cooking dinner or cleaning up the kitchen, fixing lunches or whatever. I keep a, th um, a bag of things that she can sit and do quietly. So I have things in here like slime, Play-Doh, crayons, markers, um, card game, matching games. Um, so I just kind of keep some of this stuff on hand um, in the kitchen so that she can just kind of play with while I cook or I clean up. 
however i've just been storing it in a ziploc bag but i think i'm going to try to reuse this basket and kind of make this her quiet time um, play basket that can go underneath here so let's just see So here's another cabinet where I've just stuck holiday decor in or just random things in. Um, so let me see if I can get this cleared out. It's a mess.
All right, guys, so all the cabinets are done. They're organized. Everything is neatly in a spot. Um, have some free shelves up there. And, oh, the junk drawers are no longer filled. Now, obviously, these trays don't fit very well in here. But I just think for the time being, they'll serve its purpose. <clears throat> but it looks 100% better than it did. So those are all cleaned out. I have underneath here just um, appliances. So small appliances I have decided to put underneath this one for the most part. And then under here, I told you guys I have um, just some other little larger things. And I have this basket. This basket here is Kaylee's quiet time basket. So I just pulled this out when I'm cooking dinner or cleaning the kitchen. It just kind of gives her activity to do um, quietly while I finish cleaning up. And then just some more appliances underneath there. And then up here we have um, just move some stuff around. I put all of the kids' cups and everything in here, cups and thermos and all that stuff. I just kind of put here in this basket. Um, everything else just neatly on the shelves. I don't know if you guys saw this, but this is just those. You know your utensil drawer and then this is still not perfect I, I think I don't want to use these in here um, but for now it's okay and it's just the extra extra tops for the thermos and cookie cutters stuff like that underneath here is just um, bows uh, my cutting board the kids um, lunch boxes and stuff I put underneath here as well and I wasn't able to use this um, this was too tall for what I want to use it for and I wanted to put it underneath here to put the pants in but it's too tall I mean obviously I can adjust um, this top shelf but I didn't want to do that and then let me tip my space up top as well. So I just neatly placed them down here. So I do know all my sheet pans and everything is over here. Um, my Tupperware bowls and stuff like that on this side. Uh, oh, and the spices. So here's what the spices look like when I put them in those jars. I like these jars and I know everybody's saying, well, how you, you know, you're going to shake it, but you guys know you're supposed to measure your seasonings <laughs> so um I, I hope this will help me measure because i honestly truthfully i just shake 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 and stop when i feel um but anyway this is what that's looking like here um i really like it i like the labels and i think i'm gonna get a wider shelf because if i put them i mean they'll fit here but it'll make it kind of hang off a little bit. So it's not too bad. And I may end up keeping it. Who knows? This does expand to be longer if you need it to be. And I do have some extra jars. I put them up here. And they're kind of my larger seasonings that I, um, I, I did put some of them in here. All of it didn't fit. So if I had any leftovers, I put over here. And this is just condiment stuff like that. They have your measuring cups and stuff like that in here. So anyway, it is everything is neat. <clears throat> and then over here, I did switch out this drawer here. So I decided to put my kitchen towels and all that stuff in this drawer closer to the sink. I have my sponges. I decided to put these in here. I mean, we use these sometimes when we're barbecuing or something. So anywho, I just stuck them in there and then underneath here where i had all of my holiday decor stuff i took out and so now i just really place like my vases that i use for my flowers and stuff 
it's underneath here coasters uh, the first aid kit is back there as well and so yes I have cleared out all of holiday decor out of this one and then over here so I just kind of left this the same these are just the diffusers and um, the kids humidifier I just kind of left in there and I cleared out uh -oh, the other holiday decor so there's really not anything in there really um, just a couple home decor pieces that I put in there so but yeah that is it so everything is neatly in its place um, I am most proud of this drawer these junk drawers I pray that we're able to keep it just like this um, and not junk it up anymore so hopefully we can keep this the same and in this is just really necessity I mean I guess not really necessities I kind of use keep Willa a couple tubes and stuff like that on hand that he wants to have in the house so these are remotes to lights and stuff like that so anyway but this is the end of the video if you guys like please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe if you haven't done so already and until i see you guys in the next one y'all have a blessed blessed week bye all right guys so after i posted the after look of the video i forgot to show you guys these two drawers um so these two drawers which are located by the oven um, I decided to put my foil in and my Ziploc bags and in this one um, I just put my larger utensils in here and I use those drawer dividers to do so um, in these two drawers so I realized that I didn't show you guys what those two drawers look like but this is it and I also didn't show you guys these just because these are pretty much the same from like we moved in I just kind of sit them in here like that so I didn't really need to organize them well, I guess this one could have been better organized but <laughs> they're pretty much um, the same and then um, the cabin set of cabin trees over the coffee bar didn't need to be organized they've been pretty much the same as well since we moved in and that's just with the mugs and the glasses um so this portion of it didn't really need to be um organized so that's it guys i just want to share that with you